makeup look is going to be on this dark green smoky eye. I actually posted this look on my Instagram a few months ago and it got so many reposts and I I didn't even know why. This was actually one of those looks that I created and I didn't really like it at the time. I just thought it was a bit eh, you know. But um, I grew to love it and this has actually been the most requested makeup look I've had so far. So if you'd like to see how to achieve it, please keep watching. So the first thing I'm going to do is apply MAC Studio Finish Concealer in NC20 as a base. Taking Makeup Geek's Creme Brulee and Frappe, apply them to your crease using a big fluffy brush. I believe this is the E35 by Sigma. With MAC's 217 Blending Brush, apply MAC's Embark to your crease. Also go back with your Sigma E35 Blending Brush and blend well. You want all these colours to blend in with each other seamlessly. Apply MAC's Pearl Glide Intense Liner in Undercurrent to your lid. And just blend that out, but don't go past your crease. You want to take Stash from the Urban Decay Vice 2 palette and apply that to your lid using padding motions. Also go back with that E25 blender brush and blend the green to the Renault Harsh lines. And I'm just applying Shroom by MAC to my brow bone. Apply your eyeliner and create a wing. I am using Makeup Geek's Immortal Gel Liner and a MAC 210 brush. And I applied Max Feline to my waterline. So I skipped my brows and foundation as you guys have seen me do them multiple times. If you would like to see how I do my brows, please check my previous video. So I first applied my Bobbi Brown Concealer and blended it out with a beauty blender. And I am now applying my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in light and blending that out. So I'm just going to set that all using the banana shade from the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit. So I'm going to take Corrupt Eyeshadow by Makeup Geek and run that under my lower lash line and blend out. So you just want to take that undercurrent liner and apply it to your lower lash line and then take that same brush you used for your lid and apply some of the stash eyeshadow on top of that. Apply some mascara to your top and bottom lashes and then apply your lashes. These are Noir Fairy by House of Lashes. And now you just want to begin sculpting your face. I am using Fawn from the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit. And now you just want to apply some blush to your cheeks. This is Cream Soda by MAC. I believe it is limited edition. And you just want to lightly apply some highlighter to your cheekbones. This is Superb by MAC. And for lips, I am just applying MAC's Creme de Nude lipstick and lightly lining it with Subculture Lip Liner. And just finishing that off with Napoleon Purtis Lip Gloss in Casey. And this is the finished look. I really hope you guys learnt something new today. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I will see you in my next video. Bye!